Welcome to today's tutorial on how to cut a princess tag. Today I'm going to be starting with a pair of scissors, a pack of pin I didn't use, a piece of tailor's chuck, of course my measuring tape, and a piece of fabric. So I took my neck dimensions at 4 inches for neck width and 4 inches for neck depth. My shoulder is 17 and which means I took 8.5 inches. But then when cutting a princess that because when you cut with your actual actual shoulders it jumps and shortens your post width. One trick I learned is to add an extra inch to your shoulders. So when you are done shaping your armhole and cutting the princess that you can now take up that one extra inch. So my has a way of preventing the bust from shortening. So I'm just taking my initial shoulders there of 8.5. I'm marking that because when we are done cutting the that, I'll still have to cut other excess one inch. Then I'm marking the allowance for the that. Then I'm taking my ample depth at 8 inches. I drew that and then made it look nice and curvy. So because I, I said that we were going to, I was going to cut off the one inch I added later. That's the reason I'm drawing that straight line. So when I'm done cutting with the princess that I'll know where my actual dad is and I can take off the excess. I'm just going to take my normal dart width. That this is my body dart now. I'm just going to take my normal dart width, which goes at four inches. beautiful your dad comes out it really depends on how much you can curve in or carve in the shape into your fabric so when you are trying to when you are drawing the princess that the shape for the princess that make sure it goes like it's curvy there are no pointed ends i kind of still struggle with that because i notice some people just shape their princess that one way but me i have to go in over and over again to make sure i don't have a pointed end because it's going to affect the overall outcome of my dress so i'm trying to shape it out making sure there's no curved but there's no pointed angle any pointed place <laughs> you can see i was i like i went in separately because i wanted it to really come out nice and smooth When I was done with the shaping, I just wiped off the excess chalk so you, you would see the main line I'm working with. Yeah, there you go. Next up is to cut my neckline and to shape out my armhole and all those things. Like, it's time to cut, baby. Let's cut and make this that happen. <laughs> so, I cut out my neckline. Proceeded to cutting out my shoulder lines. Then I cut out my armhole. It says that is something that's actually very easy to cut. That's if you get your measurements right. If you don't, you're really going to struggle with it. So when I was done cutting out my arm, 
school all i did was when i went in with my scissors and i just cut through the fabric with, with the guideline of the lines i've made of, of the princess that so i just went in slowly and cut it out there you go that's your princess that but when you're done cutting you'd have to take out that one extra inch that you added to the shoulders yeah i know some people will be like oh what happened to the bust line when you're done joining the shoulders and it doesn't fit to it don't worry when you join the butt, when you join it to the center part the side when you join them to the center part and if it's kind of excess you can see trim it out a little but you need your shoulders to be on point like to be accurate if not it will shorten your bust line it's better you cut out excess bust line than it's not been enough so i'm going ahead to shaping the back bodies i use this as a as an example on how to shape the back bodies you you can cut the front and the back part together but then there's just this little excess you have to take out from the back so that's what i'm just showing you here how to take off the excess from the back because you know our back is not exactly straight so if you just use how you cut the front part and sewing it back into the back like that it won't fit in well so if you've cut the back and front together no worries all you just do is separate the the front from the back then move to this to the side parts of the princess that and just take out that excess that small excess shape it a bit take it out yeah cut it and your back will be well laid like you see those suits that the back looks well laid this is what they do Try it out and let me know how.